Hey, I'm starting to fix another uh, transmission control computer uh, for an automatic transmission, and I figured I'd show you a little bit what I'm doing. Um, here, here's some bad capacitors. These aren't all from this board. I've been, uh, I don't know why I've been saving. I'm going to throw them out, but it's kind of why I made this video. I figured I'd show you them before I threw them out. Um, I'm going to zoom in here so you can see the work on the motherboard. But took these capacitors out. Hold on, it's gonna be a little jumpy there. And like you can see right there, hope. Oops. So this is where the capacitors were these spots here and there's some others up farther but you can see those three circles there uh, looks like it says C28, C33 and C32 and I'll back up here and again those are these capacitors here so what I do is I take them out um, with my soldering iron and then my uh, I'm trying to get a smaller drill bit. Zoom in on this. Give you an idea. This pretty small drill bit. But I actually want to get a smaller one. And I was kind of impatient, so I just used this one. Um, and I got one on order that's even smaller. I want to use a 22, uh, a 22 wire gauge. Um, that's the kind of normal size of uh, jumper wire. Um, and hopefully that'll make it a little bit of a nice smaller hole because I worry about when I drill this out if I get too much of the solder out Let's see if we can see this one here this is the back some of the holes on the back if I drill too big it it won't make contact with the motherboard anymore so I have to be careful about um, using that drill bit but again I got a impatient so hopefully that won't mess things up um, but I wanted to get this one done. So what I'll do now is uh, put new capacitors on there and solder those on and then the board should be good to go and I'll test it out in my car. And This is going to go into a 1991 Honda Accord. Uh, and this particular one's a DX. I don't know if that matters or not. Oh, I think it does. Um, this is a 1991 Honda Accord DX. Um, DX just means everything's manual as far as the window. It doesn't have any power locks or anything like that. Um, anyways, that's it.